Okay, welcome to Jesse DePinto. He's a true fan. I, I just got invited to Milwaukee here to give a few lectures. Jesse, tell us why why did you bring me over here? What's 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 going on? Uh, so I've been a, a fan of open source ecology for a while. Um, really believe in the cause, and I'm just trying to help um, spread it, uh, spread the word about uh, what's going on, and especially in Milwaukee. Uh, so Milwaukee's got uh, high potential for. Uh, innovation, especially in the hardware space. So, um, with uh, you know, I, there's three schools in the five-minute uh, drive from each other that uh, I thought would uh, de benefit from Marchin coming by and talking, and I think the Marchin would benefit from all the students that could potentially help the cause there. The stu the schools are so. Just uh, so, University of Wisconsin Milwaukee, uh, M Milwaukee School of Engineering, and Marquette University. All right. That's excellent. I'm glad to be here. So tell us a little bit about your company here. So this is Voxelmetric. So th we are a 3D scanning uh, consulting company. So we've designed three different 3D scanning technologies for different uh, clients. Um, and right now we're uh, pseudo-named uh, 3D figure works. So we are, um, so right now the, uh, the idea is to create uh, low cost 3D scanning uh, instant capture photo booths. Uh, like the one that you see here. Are they open uh, source? Uh, they are not. <laughs> they are not, but we have other things, our other 3D scanners that are, are open source. Um, okay. So we have a structured light 3D scanner. It's called the D3D scanner on Thingiverse right now. Um, we have um, right here the uh, um, kind of like the uh, um, same technology in the 3D system sense um, that uses prime sense technology. Um, that we have built, and then um, that's open source, or and and it, it, it may very well be depending on the future of, of this product line. Mm -hmm. Yeah, just a question on the the three scanner that is open source. Is the software for it? That part is not open source on that, right? Uh, correct. Okay. The uh, the software is the tough part to find open source. Most of the open source libraries um, are not. Uh, near commercial quality. But hopefully with Jeff Moe's work at Lulzbot, that is getting made, yes, right? Yes, hopefully. Mm -hmm. uh, we've mm -hmm. been talking to Jeff for a couple of years about trying to get that done, so maybe um, soon enough we can uh, see something. Yeah, excellent. Okay, thanks, Jesse. Sure. Okay.